Hello friend, welcome to my channel. Today, what is penetration test? What is the penetration test? What is its benefit? And how we do this test? All these things I am going to discuss in my channel. So, without further delay, Let's get started and one more thing, if you want to learn something new or you want to know in very deeply regarding these penetration test then watch the video till the end, brush up your knowledge, enrich your concept. This is the 7th video of bearing capacity, I already have uploaded the 6th video regarding this chapter in case you missed this video or playlist go to this i section and check out my last six video otherwise you can go to the playlist section and there you find the one playlist is called peering capacity you will find the all six video in this playlist so yes now let us start it what is the penetration test as usual before starting the penetration test i want to say few point our soil subject is too much important why because our aim is to find bearing capacity right as well as we have to find the consistency index consistency index why consistency index because by this thing we have to find out what is its flow value what is its liquid limit what is its plastic limit what is its linkage limit okay what is darkness index lots of thing we can find this whole consistency chapter right and the very basic things is density index that's our some primary aim from a soil sample these three things generally related to this penetration test if you have the penetration test value that is known as in just remember in my last video i talk about in less than 15 or 15 less than in less than 30 just remember video in where so that n is very much important and that n we can find from this penetration test okay in our market in our market there are two types of penetration test one is your standard penetration test standard penetration test another is your cone penetration some people saying that this is spt some people saying is that cpt no issue okay today under this penetration test video we'll discuss standard penetration test let's get started our standard standard penetration test okay before starting this video we have to know what is our standard ice code for this test so generally we follow is 2131 1981 generally follow this is our is code for standard penetration test before starting this test, we have to know, we have to understand that what is its equipment or you can say apparatus. Generally, one thick wall split spooner may use and outer diameter 50.8 mm inner diameter 
35 mm and we use this is your one this two and we use ramar or can say him ramar both are same functional same weight of these ramar is 63.5 kg okay so this is comes under equipment section now we talk about the main thing test procedure test procedure okay generally this speed spooner is placed on board hole and generally a natural naturally penetration occur matlab सपोज दिस इज योर बोर होल ये आपका हो गया जी एल और आपने क्या किया यू ड्रॉप दिट और नॉर्मल ड्यू टू वेट थोड़ा पेंटेस्टेड हो गया ठीक है पॉइंट नंबर टू नाउ वी डू रामाड़ी the height of free fall 75 cm or 750 mm so that this is your ramar free fall from 75 cm up to what up to what up to what up to 30 cm matlab this is your bore from here you have to penetrate 30 cm till 30 cm you have to do ramaring okay every 15 cm every 15 cm record the number of blow if we talk about 30 cm penetration first 15 second 15 first 15 known as your sitting drive sitting drive and second 15 is your penetration resistance so this is all about the test process if you have some doubt do comment now we talk about some correction so here i can write correction for n valve now we see is how many types of correction generally there is two types of correction one is your overt burden correction second is your submerge submergence or dilatancy dilatancy correction that two correction okay so for overburden correction n0 equal to cn n this n we found from the test and that cn is your your coefficient that is known as your normalizing correction factor and for dilatancy n e equal to 15 plus n0 minus 15 that n0 that n0 comes from here and that n e is your dilatancy correction so yeah this is your whole penetration test where i discuss what is the reason for doing the penetration test then i talk about the two types of penetration then i talk about the is code then i talk about the equipment specification then i discuss the test procedure and what is the significance of the 15 and another 15 total 30 and then i talk about the correct n value okay 
So this is a very simple video regarding bank distribution test. So if you have any doubt or any kind of feedback, so definitely without hesitation do comment in the comment section. And if you feel so, you learned something new from this video, then like, share, subscribe this video and share this video with your friend because gyan badne se gyan badta hai. And yeah. Next video, we we'll talk about the CPT test. Till then, bye bye. Take care and 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 thanks for watching this video.